Hi guys, welcome back to my kitchen. This is Chef Ajay and I'll be cooking today Britain's favorite lamb dinner. This recipe was requested by one of our lovely diner at Swadesh. So this recipe is for you. Let's get started. So we'll start uh, by marinating our lamb with ginger garlic, red chili powder and a touch of salt. So we'll give a nice mix. So we'll leave our lamb to rest for about 10 minutes. So we'll start by roasting our spices. I have uh, my cinnamon, my black cardamom, cloves, black peppercorns, fennel, red chilies and bay leaf. We'll roast them on a low heat. We will know our spices are nicely roasted when aroma comes out of them. So this is a time when we will take our spices off the pan. I'm using the ghee here. It's better if your fat is saturated. Now we will go with our roasted whole spices. And we'll cook them for about 2 to 3 minutes till the flavors of the whole spices are infused in our oil. Now we will go in with our finely chopped onions. You have to make sure that your Onions are finely chopped. This is one of the secrets for the beautiful sauce of our lamb buna. So we'll cook our onions until they are nicely browned, but no overly cooked. We'll add our ginger garlic paste. Cook it for a minute or so. So my onions are nicely browned. Make sure when you cook your onions your flame is on a medium low because you want to fry the onions, you don't want to burn them. My onions are ready now, so I'm going to go in with my powder spices. I've had my coriander, my cumin powder. Garam masala. red chili powder We'll cook our powder spices for about a minute or so. My powder spices are very well cooked now and this is the time to put the tomatoes. We'll cook our tomatoes till the oil comes on surface. It takes about five to ten minutes, so we'll wait. We'll cook patiently. It takes a little bit longer to cook our spices, but in the end result is beautiful. We'll add our salt. Our sauce looks ready. This is the time when we go in our pan with our lamb. We'll cover this pan at this time and let our lamb cook in its juices on a, a low flame. We'll take a look at our lamb buna. Make sure that you let your condensation water drop in the lamb itself because this is where the flavor is. Give a nice stir. Take a look at your lamb. It looks like it's cooking very well. It's a time to add a little bit more water. Remember, this is a lamb curry. It takes about for 40 to 50 minutes I add a little bit more water and we'll let it simmer on a very very low heat for another 10 minutes and then we'll take another look
Our lamb curry is ready now, and I'm going to finish it with fresh coriander, some garam masala, and I'm gonna give it a nice stir. There you go, guys. This is my lamb tuna made easy for you. I hope you love watching this video, and thanks for tuning in. Please do like and share this video, and do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Until next time, goodbye.